A 14 year old boy charged with capital murder in the deaths of a pregnant woman, her baby and her mother. Tonight we're digging deeper to find out how the justice system will evaluate the rare case. The night team's Patty Santos talks to the chief juvenile probation officer about the several ways this case could be prosecuted. The family of the mother and pregnant daughter killed wants the 14 year old charged with their murders to pay with his life. Death penalty for me. I don't care how old he is because he didn't touch his heart. He took three lives. But a Supreme Court ruling protects anyone under 18 years old from being executed. Now a complex criminal justice system will determine what happens to the teen facing capital murder charges. Most of the kids come in on misdemeanors um, rather than felonies. Um, very few come in on very serious charges such as murder, capital murder. Lynn Wilkerson, chief probation officer for the county's juvenile probation division, says a child could get sentenced to probation. In more serious cases, a minor could be sentenced to a definite term of up to 40 years. In those cases, the juvenile would serve time in the system until they turn 19 when they would be transferred to the adult system. The other option is what's called certifying transfer, where a child can be certified as an adult. The the court would look at the minor's maturity and sophistication at the time of the crime and consider public safety. The court looks at the history, the previous history of the child. The court looks at um, whether keeping the child in the juvenile system would provide adequate protection for the public or whether transferring to the adult system would be uh, more protective. In an adult trial, the minor would go straight into an adult prison. And the team will make his first court appearance tomorrow. Attorneys have up to a month to decide if the teen will be charged and tried as an adult. And uh, Wilkerson tells us the victims will also, uh, the victim's family will also have a say through this process. Steve.